What's happening folks and welcome to another episode of Stars of Tomorrow, an FM20 Wonder Kid series where we look at some of the young talent on Foot Manager and we see how the game reckoned they've got in the course of their careers. So today's player is Filip Stevanovic. If you've got a player you want to look at, down in the comments section leave his name and as much info as you can on him, but also check the playlist first and make sure he's not been done already because obviously um i when it comes to redoing players from like the old patch i pick that that's the way i do it but obviously new players you guys give me them and if we're not players from suggestions which definitely will we've got loads to get through i will then pick and try and find some myself so if you don't if you've done this series smash the like button down below subscribe if you're new check out twitch channel as well live on tuesdays fridays and Saturdays, so this is going to be live on Tuesday's video, I believe. So we're live streaming tonight at 6 p.m. As this episode's going live, I'm on Twitch. So jump over there after seeing the video. Love to see you over there. Playing Axe Save, just chilling out on Axe Save and having some fun. So yeah. So Felix Stanovic, um, we'll go quickly look at his abilities and his potential ability ratings and uh, update you on that. So his current ability is 111. Um, his recommended Current ability 115 and pitch ability is minus 85. Its potential ability range is 104 to 170. So that gives you some idea what you're getting into here. I think obviously this kind of again, if you use this series, this is a new thing we do now. I thought, given that we're just exploring the save anyway, and you guys are getting a free scouting video on a player, advanced scouting report on him, why not put all the information in there? That's the nature of the series to find as much info on this guy without you find signing him and see if he's worth before you sign him to see if he's worth getting for your save. So he's a left winger who can play AMC. Um 16 years old on youth contract for Partisan. He's been there how long now? For four years now. Um very obviously youth contract could be interesting. Fish agreed to sign a um pro deal on the okay, so bear that in mind. Um so yeah. Like loving the pace at uh, 16 year old, loving it. Fantastic. Dribbling, fantastic as well. Great passing, great technique. For a 16 year old, this guy is fantastic. So, yes, if you want this guy, I'm going to say right now, get him early. Don't wait because I've got a sticky feeling that if you don't get him early on and the AI deals with him, you get the whole we don't develop players that well deal. So, first jump, let's go. So, guys, now 20 years old and he's gone to Atletico Madrid and we've seen. Slow increases across the ball, like two or one or two um, levels up or, or mounts up, whatever you want to call it. Um, the main attributes that stand out for me are the dribbling still, the first touch, the long shots, passing and technique. The pace is very good. Good decision making, good vision as well. So the pass, the pass, the technique, vision and passing, that triangle is very good for me, very handy, I believe. Um, so how was he done with the injury record here? Let's have a look. At one major injury for a hip injury, and it was four months out. Fair enough. Um, so I want to look at his player traits. I don't think he's got any. No, he hasn't. What kind of weak foot has he got? Very strong and strong. So I'd, you know, two footed more or less. Um, I would say on that. So obviously worth twelve point five, twelve point five million pounds. How has he got on those? So we saw his partisan here didn't play much. Next year got eight goals, seven assists. Then got six goals, five assists. Went to Madrid. First year, didn't really play a lot in that first season. Um, 8.5 million pounds of bottom for a bargain. Absolute bargain, in my opinion. And then first full season, at, well, first real season at Atletico Madrid uh, in terms of games, he got two goals, one assist. But still, though, at 20 years old, this guy is still very, very, very valuable. He got four to million pounds in his clause. It's, again, it's critical of, this is him at 20 years old, guy. 20 years old, look at him now. The key thing is playing him, developing him, um, and making sure he gets the right amount of football and training and mentoring, all that kind of stuff. So let's see what the um, bosses and the higher ups at Atletico do with him. Uh, next jump, let's go. Right, folks, he's now at Borussia Dortmund and he's worth £45.5 million. Dribbling 16, first with 15, risky, all risky the same path from the acceleration 14. Um, Still valid, still, still can play two positions. Don't know player traits on him, either foot, so two footed. Like, I didn't, I don't, I didn't notice that earlier. Hmm. Uh, tactics been playing left wing mainly at this point. Wanted by Bayern Munich, go figure. Um, 
That's that's new, isn't it? At Dortmund, they're going to Bayern Munich. That's legit. Never happened before, has it, lads? If you're a Dortmund fan, if, you, if you're a Dortmund fan, if you're a Dortmund fan, I just, <laughs> how do you not want to just scream to a pillow when Dortmund have to sell a player to Bayern Munich every almost every time? Um, I'm surprised Haaland did. and I, I was, Alton Alton Haaland going there. Just you know, probably not, but you never know. So injuries. Let's look again. Not too bad. Um, not too bad, really, in my opinion. Not too worrying there for me. Career stats. So, second year we saw he got two goals, one assist that season. Then he got um, five assists. But again, not starting many games. Then again, not starting. Got bought for £22 million. Started a lot more games for Dortmund in the first season he, he, he was there. Got four goals, three assists. Then got three goals, two assists. Seems to be more of a squad player in both these squads uh, at the moment. Uh, both, both teams, sorry. Um, I think he's better than that. I think... I think you're playing more. I think if you're playing more in these area in this period here, as like Madrid, because you look at the techniques, good. The passing's good. Physics good. Dribbling's good. The pace is there. The composure's there. The finishing could be improved. It's two footed as well. Again, this is about playing him early on, but this is how the AI is played. If you if you look it out in this way, how we usually do it, they've not played him much from the start and not built a team around him much. And yet he's got these kind of stats, you know. If you were to play him a lot more and really use your again, like I, like I always say, the game is not is not as good as us or you guys, not me. You guys are developing players because you guys can go really focus on a player in depth and really make sure that you get the best out of him. Um, if again, well, may not always work, but you can, you know, we can go more tailor made approaches and. You know, with more knowledge and whatever. Um, so, yeah. Um, I want to see if he can get his goal assist record up. Let's find out. Well, guys. Yeah. Gone to Bayern Munich. Art imitating life. Um, to be honest with you. So, as you can see here now, well, get the same stats again. Only one that's gone down, really. Dribbling down to 15 and the acceleration down to 13. Play up 16, technique 16, um, which have increased. Uh, no player trait, still two-footed. Wanted by Zebre. So Juventus. Unless I'm not allowed to say that. Well, on there forever. Um, injuries, have a look. Another serious injury there for three months, uh, which was a torn knee ligament. Um, rest pretty much okay, in my opinion. Not too worried about those injuries. And then see here, four goals, two assists. Then go three goals that year. They sold him to Bayern Munich for £31.5 million. Pound. Got six goals, four assists. Eight goals, five assists. And nine goals, six assists. Like I said, playing more, they go up. And I think if you do that earlier on, these increase even more so. Um, with £15 million. Pound. Already, I'd say the fees are very reasonable. 8.5, 22 and 31.5. Very reasonable fees, not massive amounts. You can maybe even do kind of like a structured deal where it's based on goals, appearances or whatever. Um, I'll split it out of cost of period if you want to as well and it's even cheaper deal than isn't it um in theory um so yeah um he's playing more he's getting double goals total goals and assist at Bayern Munich let's see if it continues stats are basically it is basically his prime these are his prime stats really aren't they so yeah let's go for one more jump guys and see um if he can break the figures for goals at least once Right, folks, he's gone to Wolves. He's now 32 years old. We're not going to focus on the stats because they're going to drop off, drop off massively. Uh, let's have a look at injuries. Again, nothing really significant after the three-month injury, in my opinion. Uh, so let's go to career stats. Have a look. Oh, God. Um, <laughs> he's gone here, there, everywhere. So you can see here, he left for £41.5 million pounds from Arsenal. Got There we go. 11 goals, 13 assists first year. Then he got not many at all. Then he moved on to Everton. Where he didn't do much there either, 39.9, 39.5 million million. Second goal, second season got five goals. Went to Southampton, got three goals, two assists, and then alone. So, yeah, you saw here in the Premier League, 11 goals, 13 assists. In the right team, he's definitely got it. Um, I would say, plus size, this guy, B's reasonable, around the 30 million pound mark, um, for 25 ish million pound ish, roughly. Uh, getting him earlier on, I think that's definitely still a thing I would say. I would definitely play him more than they did in the um, period at Let's Go Madrid. Play him more than them. He's got the pace, not on the screen, but he's got the pace. He's got um, the two-footed 
um, aspect to him as well. He can play AMC. I think he's, if you get that finishing higher on him, you've got a quality player. And I think um, he's not over expensive either. So yeah, really interesting player. Really enjoyed this review. If you enjoyed this review, words fail me. If you've enjoyed this review and you I hope you have, hit the like button down below. Smash the like button, smash the subscribe button as well if you're new. Check out the Twitch channel and the second channel down below as well. There's a good video link at the end, at the end of this with the second channel on it. I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.